What's going on YouTube? I am Squirrel. We are back in the squirrel's nest to do what I do best. And of course, that's pop some boxes, crack some packs, see what I can't get going on for us today. So as anybody that's watched a previous video of mine, or just kind of probably could guess, um, I always throw a couple cards in the background to kind of set the mood for what we're about to open. Some of my luckier pools or just some of the better cards that I like even just personally. So today I've got Curtis Weaver out of 149, representing my Steelers, Cameron Hayward out of 50, and a big pull out of one of the last boxes I opened, a Tua Tagovailoa rookie auto out of 50. Boom, there we go. So today's gonna be a special, special video. Today we're gonna do a pretty big box war. Um, I got my buddy Harvey Dent, which is one of my longtime subscribers on my channel. Uh, he saw one of the last box wars, hit me up, asked me how does he get involved. I told him, and here we are. So, all I can say is good luck, and we'll see what happens. Welcome to Box Wars. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the main event. On the left, we'll have Harvey Dent. On the right, we'll have myself. Let's get ready to rumble! So I guess there's really nothing left to it but to do it. Uh, I guess we will open his first. So let's pop these boxes, crack these packs, and good luck, buddy. <laughs> now that's the point of no return right there. Good luck, good luck, good luck. So this has been a product this year that is, it's been treating me okay. I haven't done great, but I haven't done horrible either. You know, that two in the background is a sign of, I've been doing pretty decent. Alright, so this is going to work. Best auto takes everything. Whoever has the best auto wins both boxes. So good luck. Alright. Oh, first card, he's got one of my Steelers. Oh, no. And it's an Anthony McFarland Jr. 34 of 46. Anthony McFarland Jr. Nice card, buddy. I like these metal cards. I think they're pretty cool. All right. Next up, we've got... Oh, ho, 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 ho. you definitely don't want to lose this box now. we got a Joe Burrow Supercharged 194 out of 199. That was almost a bookend. Uh, in case anybody doesn't know what the bookends are, it's the 199 out of 199, or the 1 out of 199. It's the bookends, get it? <laughs> Anyways, got the big old black napkin of there. Joe Burrow, supercharged. But it's best autograph takes everything. So, boom. Oh, no. Okay. Well, he's got RPS, Rookie Steel Signatures, Antonio Gibson. Antonio Gibson is his first card, and it's a ridiculous. Redemption. Not real thrilled about um, Panini Redemptions. They tend to take a while. But uh, hopefully you've got a better card coming. And it is... Ooh, look at that. 13 out of 25, Lynn Bowden Jr. That is a gorgeous card. Wow. 
That is awesome. Awesome sauce. All right. Well, I know you definitely don't want to lose this box. That's a pretty nice card right there. All right. Well, now, on to my box. Here we go. Dun dun dun. <laughs> oh, I love this stuff. I love box wars. I love doing them. I love being in them. I do them on other people's channels all the time. Alright. Are we doing this right? Yeah. There we go. I guess. Alright. Here we go. Card number one. Hey, I got a Tua Tagaviola rookie card on the middle. I believe this is going to be out of 46 itself. Well, we got some of the plastic peeling off there. That's all right. It's just a protective cover. As you can see, it says peel off protective color cover. I advise you, if you guys have any of these, don't pull that plastic off. Um... They tend to be worth more with that on there if you ever go to resell them. Just a little hint of the hobby. To a tag of Viola. Man. Ah, I know I'm not wanting to lose this box. And Jalen Hurts. Man, I am a magnet for this dude. 129 out of 199 with the... Green napkin in there. Frequency. Jalen Hurts. Alright. My first auto is... Herman Moore. From the Detroit Lions. Herman Moore. 37 out of 99. That's funny. If anybody has watched this any of my previous videos you'll know why this is so funny wow <laughs> this is literally the second time i've pulled this card that's just wow all right and boom nate stanley 36 out of 75 future neon signs 36 out of 75 All right, well, I am going to pause this video real fast and go run some comps and see what I can't figure out. So it's only going to seem like a second for you guys, but it's probably going to take me a few minutes. So I'm going to cut and comp and I'll get right back with it. Hang tight. Well, not like you're going anywhere. <laughs> and I'm back. All right, so now I've got everything sleeved and top loaded and all pretty. Um, as I thought, I really didn't need to go comp everything, but I did just to be sure. Um, the Herman Moore and Antonio Gibson don't even play a role in this, honestly. But the Lynn Bowden beats out the Nate Stanley. Um, yeah, it pretty much wasn't even really a fight, to be honest. Uh, we've got the Nate Stanley out of 75, sold for $28.90 on August 16th. But then the out of 75... Lynn Bowden sold for thirty-two fourteen on August nineteenth, and that was out of seventy-five. So, yeah, it's not even a really a contest. So, uh, yeah, congratulations. 
um we'll get that packed up and shipped out to you that was a uh <laughs> that was a pretty hard pill to swallow man so congratulations um it's all yours i will get these packed up shipped out to you and uh just get with me and dm me your address so i can get those out i'll get those uh shipped out as soon as i can yeah that was a pretty hard beat there wow congratulations um uh, there were some really good cards in that i mean you got the tua you got the burrow you got the lynn bowden out of 25 the herman moore the nate stanley oh and just before i go the reason i said the herman moore was so funny out of 99 twins twin it to win it yeah we pulled this card i don't know a couple videos ago so that's just wow 23 and 37 of 99 so there's only 99 of these and do you know how slim of a chance that is that i would open both boxes with those in it pretty crazy but anyways appreciate you guys hanging out with me congratulations um what a win for you harvey just i i still can't get over it i mean i know you would have been pretty upset if you would have lost too so congratulations um i appreciate everybody hanging out with me again i'm blessed and thankful to be able to do this share the hobby do these box wars they are so much fun win lose or draw i enjoy them they're a lot of fun to do and uh that's about the gist. I appreciate you guys. As always, you ain't got to go home, but you can't stay here. Catch you on the next one.